Happy Friday, everybody. This is a pick a card reading for today, December 10th, Friday. You pick a card, it's your main energy. I pull them all together. They're all for us anyway. And December 10th, birthdays. We'll do your birthday. We'll do your birthday next. Okay, it's your birthday today. Happy birthday. We'll do your reading next. If you pick card number one, you have a major arcana of the judgment card. This is an energy of um, an important decision, I want to say, or a choice. Um, it could be dealing with property matters, money, wealth, prosperity, abundance, and gaining better financial insight. Um, there is abundance in the workings here, okay? Your efforts are going to pay off. This is making um, some good financial management and decisions, um, is I'm, I'm thinking, for some of you. There's something important on your mind. Um, it is um, something that you could draw money and wealth in to you, but you do also have to check all requirements and um, it could be something that you may do later is what I'm feeling. But... All that you want and desire is there within, I want to say, the future for you, okay? Something may be set, a secret comes out, or some information, okay? Something you're thinking of, too, that could be a major life change, may occur in maybe the half or like... I want to say several months from now. Or you may do something at that point. It's interesting, okay? Very interesting. Some of you may be dealing with, I, I, there's someone out there maybe thinking of selling a farm, a ranch, buying cattle for some reason that came to me too so it is someone out there card number two eight of cups this could be a day where you are just trying to convince yourself or move forward An emotional perspective, if you keep moving forward, you don't know where you're going. You feel you've been through an emotional roller coaster, but you are moving ahead. You're creating a safer space for you. You're emotionally kind of shut down, meaning you're kind of holding it. You're not allowing others to get to you, or you're trying to put some... A block a block a, a borders up okay for a lot of you you're moving forward finding alliances or supportive people that have your best interest in heart you're more alert and you're keeping your wits about you okay trusting yourself and taking a more safer path I want to say um, there are some sudden changes that will occur. Um, and that's going to kind of maybe release an emotional burden or something is happening there. There is some resentment that you're holding on to. But mind, be mindful that it's not going to turn out a lot the way you thought it would be either. It is better. So this is walking to greener pastures is the best I can explain this. An emotional relief. Card number three is the King of Pentacles. Oof. Some of you, this is creating a stronger bond. Someone may offer you. This could be um, a business deal. Um, someone sending you some positive energy, feeling like you got the Midas touch. Um, I do feel that today you will definitely get things done. You're on a new path. A wish fulfillment. Uh, some of your goals, your dreams, you're holding on to them and you can manifest them and you will, I feel you're going to get what you want here, okay? This could be asking for what you need and you getting it too. So it's a very giving and sincere energy. Um, generosity is around you today too, okay? 
All right, so we have Judgment, we have the Eight of Cups, and we have the King of Pentacles. Um, I do feel that today we are working hard on something. Um, hard work, perseverance definitely is going to pay off, though we have some doubts and securities. We're kind of trying to build a safe nest here. Um... We will get things done moving forward. There is fast-moving energy. There could be some exciting news that comes in, too. Um, and I do feel that there is going to be some changes. Um, someone unexpectedly shows up is a thing, or new people, new experiences will be coming in. So it's like kind of out with the old, in with the new. We're kind of overprotective today. We're maybe a little defensive but we're trying to fight for our rights is what I'm feeling, okay? There is a sense of you're in the right, being angry, fighting back, protecting what you cherish. Um, you may have a good defense here too. Um, I do feel that energy. There is transformation. Things are changing, reversing the energy, rebalancing the forces here, um, there could be opposing sides here, but we could be changing our mind about something and switching uh, sides, but major life changes I feel are here for some of us. This is self, um, transformation. Now there is a strength to us. Um, we're kind of ready for battle. <laughs> uh, we have some challenges to overcome, but we will, um, um, move forward somehow. We will achieve some kind of victory, okay? I do feel that energy. Um, I do feel there is going to be some new um, additional money or something coming in. And this could be someone in your inner circle, someone that you know that comes through and helps you out. I see more positive thinking. There can be some kind of um, gathering is what I'm feeling too. Uh, kind of a very fast moving pace as well. So fast moving energy today. And something we're kind of like procrastinating as well, okay? We're a little bit cautious too. There's also a cancer energy that I'm picking up here. All right, so I do feel that energy as well. So interesting. All right, so that is the reading for today, December 10th, Friday. I hope you have a fabulous Friday. Happy birthday if you're born today, December 10th. This is a very quick and general reading. This is your soul or your theme, and that's your wish card. And you have a major arcana of the Hierophant. The Hierophant. Uh, new social groups are coming through. You may be joining a group. For some of you, you may be making some kind of deals, commitments um, with um, an institution. This could be banking. This is also maybe going back to school. For, uh, for a lot of you, trust your intuition. This is also... When your gut is telling you something, heed it. So I do see that energy. Manifestation is high as well. For some of you, um, either you will be um, in a committed relationship, talks of marriage, or someone else that you know that's close to you may announce um, a wedding or um, um, some kind of ceremony is what I'm feeling. Um, hard work, perseverance is going to pay off. I do feel that energy as well. For some of you, this is um, starting a new business that is going to expand. For some of you, it can go into something like a corporate type of energy. I mean, I'm seeing this could be expand something really huge in the future. Um, so I do see that. I do see a investment, maybe going back to school too. So I do see that kind of energy. When it comes to work, career, and school, I do see uh, popularity, I see success, I see victory, I see um, a lot of energies around you um, doing really well. When it comes to finances, this is a time to um, invest in things that is going to bear fruit in the future. So I do see that um, slowing down and making some kind of sacrifices. This means uh, financial discipline is going to build for the future for you. If you are single, I do feel that you will have a new relationship that is going to build into a committed one. Um, for other, uh, for the ones that are in a relationship, I do feel that there is going to be some kind of um, um, project or work that you may be doing, or maybe your partner goes back to school or you go back to school. Um, so I do see something that's going to elevate your, um, your, your relationship financially as well. Um, I do feel that energy as well. If this is also um, 
a future financial planning, you're going to, there's a lot of talks about money in the relationship. Okay. Um, when it comes, all relationships, you have the strength to see the, um, truth behind people. So you're going to see who's who. Okay. So I do see that you may be joining new groups and new, um, um, for some of you connecting more with the spiritual, uh, with more spiritual people as well. Okay. Interesting. And your wish for your solar year is the Knight of Swords. All right. I feel that this wish will come, come, you will hear some news, uh, for some of you very quickly. And this is going to be truths or something that's going to come through and being true to your own wish here, meaning that you're positive about it, it's going to come to fruition, okay? I think someone may help you as well. All right, the important numbers for your solar year, 8, 3, 1, 12, 6, 5, 11, 93, I hope you, and 88, I hope you have a wonderful birthday and a blessed solar year ahead. Everyone else, a wonderful Friday and bye for now.